So you might be trying to figure out how you can use the new passwords application that's within iOS 18. Now whether you have a Mac or an iPad or iPhone is basically the same process, but this is specifically for the iPhones and iPads, although the Mac you know, application is kind of the same thing as well. Now this is what the new application look like. looks like, it's just this passwords app. So once you go and open it up, it'll bring you into this page. Now there's a few things to keep in mind here. So the very top, you're going to have a breakdown out of exactly all the passwords that you have on your particular device in terms of your Apple ID account. So it's not, I think, tied to only your particular account here. It's a tied to your Apple ID account, which is cool. Now, if you want to see all of your passwords, you can see all your passwords right here. So you can tap into here. Let me just go and make sure if I click on it, it's not going to show you. So if you click on it, it's going to show you all the different you know, accounts that you basically have right here. And if you tap on it further, it's going to show you the password associated with that account. So that is something that's really cool. So if you click on it, you can go and see that basically it just shows you that this is the account right here. And if you want to go and have it, you know, built in with sign in with Apple, you can go and sign in with Apple here too. So it's a very cool thing. All these accounts I have associated specifically for my Apple ID is specifically for this. So I don't have to worry about these passwords because they're all visible and available for me right here. At the very bottom, I can go and click on the plus button here. So if I want to create an account, I can go and click on the plus button right here and I can go and create a sample account from here. So I'm not going to click on it because it's going to show you a sample password, but that's basically what you can do. Hopping out of here, it breaks it down further of exactly what type of other passwords you may have on your device. So you can always search for a password. Let's say I wanted to search for like my Monopoly stuff. I can click on here and I can just start typing in Monopoly. As you can see, it'll just show up right there, which is actually very cool. Now, if you have passkey set up, you'll see your passkey passwords right there. Under codes, if there's any code set up, you'll see that here too. Wi-Fi, any of the Wi-Fi passwords you have set up, those things will basically show up right there as well, which is another very, very cool thing. It's a simple thing. You can just see your passwords and your Wi-Fi stuff. Security and deleted. If you have any deleted passwords, those things will show up right there too. Now, at the very bottom, it's going to show you a little panel which will allow you to say like share passwords and passkeys. You'll see that stuff right there, which is really cool. At the very bottom left, you can create a new, basically, shared passwords and passkeys right there. So if you click on continue, you can go and create a new group name of different passcodes or passwords that you want to have set up within a particular panel. And you can go ahead and create a new panel. Let's say I want to share this with my family. I can go and create a new group name. I can have myself as an owner. And then I can start adding people into this from my contacts or whatever the case is. And I can go and see that stuff right in here, which is another really, really cool thing that I have the opportunity of doing. So that's basically it at a very high level that's how to use this new passwords application it's pretty basic nothing super crazy but hopefully by now you have a good understanding of how to use this particular app if you have any other thoughts or questions please let me know in the comment section below hit the like button that me so much but definitely hit that subscribe button more importantly than everything else i love every single one of you guys hopefully i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out